And TikTok a has, terrible site, a terrible app. Yeah, I it, really it, don't like TikTok. <laughs> it's uh, it's a really you know I I've never I don't have an account, but even just going on the website and just like. I can see how it's so addictive. It's you like know? Snapchat, honestly, because there's just so much like promiscuous content on mm. there. Yeah. Like geared towards grooming children and also just the addiction, very similar to Snapchat. Like they're both just. Yeah. You know, and I think you're you're getting exactly to where I'm going with yeah. this. Grooming children. And the thing yeah. about TikTok is that it's all about the algorithm. So mm-hmm. if you if you show that you uh, like a certain video about a certain topic and all you have to do is just to not scroll past it if you start watching it because i think all the videos are you know very very short yeah they are so like 15 seconds the 15 longest. seconds is it a th- or 30 seconds i don't know some Something quite bad. short clearly time i'm period. not very gen z so if you don't immediately scroll past it the algorithm will say okay you like this so we're going to show you more content like this so mm-hmm. the wall street journal created fake accounts on tiktok and they said that these are 13 to 15 year old kids thankfully these weren't actually young kids being exposed to this content. But um, when these accounts uh, were created, the algorithm started showing the videos and the algorithm very quickly started showing them sexually explicit content, sexual violence, and links to OnlyFans, which is a a platform that's Mm -hmm. full of kind of homemade pornography. And the fact that the age set on each of these, uh, they tried this 30 different times, and the age was set at 15 or younger made no difference to the pornographic content that filled the feeds of these uh, of these wow. Wall Street Journal researchers. And wow. it is insane. So, so TikTok is an app that many people regard as safe. There is not supposed to be mm-hmm. sexually explicit content on there, and that right. there it is. Because an app online... for kids, made for teens, it's not supposed to be like an ex- it's not supposed to be like mini Pornhub, you know? Right, and it's, yet, and yet, it's 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 becoming that because uh, you know the the site is trying to uh, trying to delete that content, mm-hmm. but they're not able to delete content as quickly as content is being uploaded, right. content that is explicit, and and so what we know is that mo- we're, we we know we live in a we live in an age where um, where most children will be exposed to pornography by the time they turn 13. Thanks so much for watching this video clip from the Family Beacon podcast. You can get full videos here or listen wherever you get your podcasts. Learn more at mfc.org tfb.